Two major bomb scares have shut down parts of the city today after guns and suspected explosives were found inside Royal Perth Hospital. Patients and staff were evacuated and a nearby office locked down. Mia Brankoff, two men are in custody right now. Good evening, Tim. That's right. The drama started when a man who'd just faced court left and came here to Royal Perth Hospital. Then police, the bomb squad, the TRG and firefighters were called here as people were evacuated from the top floors of the hospital. Later, a second building was evacuated. One of our biggest hospitals in lockdown. The top three floors of Royal Perth Hospital cleared just before 10 o'clock this morning. It is alarming. I mean, uh, we consider ourselves a place of safety. We, we deal with uh, very vulnerable individuals. Uh, and it's alarming, it's disturbing and it's very saddening, yes. Inside, a 29-year-old Averley man who just faced court, admitting to online child exploitation charges but freed. He was carrying a bag containing two loaded rifles and a suspected pipe bomb. Detectives at the moment are looking into the whole circumstances around the arrival of the package, uh, anyone involved with the package, and over time we'll know exactly what the cause was and, and get to the bottom of it. On the ground, it appeared calm. Firefighters and police coming and going as patients on lower floors of the hospital watched on. What, what can you do? You know, that they, uh, they, they've got to take it seriously, you know? because, because there's, there's so much going on there, guys. But inside, TRG officers were working to remove the suspicious package, while patients and doctors were relocated. Our um, priority throughout this has been the safety of patients, um, families and staff, uh, and I'd like to say that um, we've ensured that that um, has been delivered. Then, about 2 o'clock, a second emergency, this time at a lawyer's office on Hay Street. The same man, a client of Timpano Legal, had left a package there. It's about this big and it looks very innocent to me. He left this bag in the office of one of the solicitors who works up there um, to return to remove the bag post court. But then he went to the Royal Perth Hospital, I'm told. Police, firefighters and the bomb squad locked down Hay Street for an hour. The police are trying to x-ray it and assess whether it is also a bomb and hence we've all been ordered to evacuate. The package was deemed safe. The 29-year-old man was arrested. A 30-year-old is also in custody. And Mayor, police are still there at Royal Perth Hospital. Tim, forensic officers are still here. We watched as moments ago they removed several items from, from the hospital to be taken away for further investigation. Now, Royal Perth Hospital says the patients who were on that ward were affected today. They have been moved to a different area of the hospital for tonight, but they say no surgeries were cancelled as a result of today's shutdown. Police also say the two men that are in custody are expected to be charged later tonight. Tim? All right, Mia, thank you.